Madame Riznik has been teaching French immersion at James Kennedy for the last three years, and she's here today to present the Jaguars with her invention that could help teachers out of a sticky situation. Hey Jaguars, I'm so excited to be here today to present to you my new amazing life-changing product. But first, let me set the scene. Imagine this, you're in science class, you're teaching the second law of motion and you spent hours preparing for this lesson when all of a sudden you hear in the back of the room that chatter. You try to ignore and carry on, but now you're distracted. Every time you get back into your rhythm, more and more students start talking. We've all been there, but it doesn't have to be that way. Don't believe me? Look at this. Division 3. Aujourd'hui, on va apprendre de la deuxième loi de Newton. Alors, ici, il y a une question. Alors, quelle est la force nécessaire pour accélérer une skier de 70 kg à 2 mètres par seconde carré? So tell us, Jenna, what is your product? I'm so glad you asked. Let me introduce you to Bouche Bomb. This is Bouche Bomb a specially formulated chapstick. Comes in several different flavors, including raspberry, coconut, pumpkin spice. The kids will love it. Okay, I, I mean, I know this sounds great, but I don't understand how that's gonna help a student chatter. I mean, I know that kids are always like licking their lips and they get this big round rings around their mouth and, and oh, then- Okay, they, okay, Mrs. King, what? we all get it. Like students love chapstick, but what makes yours so special? I've brought some samples for you to try out. These are entirely natural ingredients and I'm selling them for the low, low price of $5 a tube. Wow, these do smell great. What do you think, Mrs. King? Mm. Mm. <laughs> so Jaguars, what do you think of Boosh Bomb? Well, I certainly can't endorse these being used for student use, but I'd take 12 for my office. Mr. Knox isn't just known for being an amazing teacher. He's also a men's league national champion in hockey. Unfortunately, this can mean some late nights. Mr. Knox is here with an arresting proposal. Hey Jaguars, picture this. It's a late night, you got a late hockey game, but you got school tomorrow and you just can't get enough rest. You get into class, you start doing that old head bob thing, you just need some sleep. Well, I've got an invention for you. To get that rest while you're working. I definitely know the feeling. I'm half asleep just listening to this go on. It's easy. Get your class up to the front for a presentation and you put on a pair of these. A to Z's. My social studies presentation is about Greek mythology and I found a really interesting myth about Medusa. Medusa was one of the three gorgons, monstrous, monstrous females with writhing serpents for hair. Anyone who looked directly Mr. at her Mr. Knox? Stone. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, exactly, great. Tatum, yeah. After dreaming about that winning goal, 20 minutes later, teaching like a champ. I'm not really sure sleeping on the job is a good look for a teacher, but would they work for a school board meeting? These will turn school board into school snored. We'll take two.
Madame Sue believes she may have found a grade A solution to every teacher's most tedious task. Good afternoon, Jaguars. I am here today to present the most revolutionary product in education since the pencil sharpener. Have you ever found yourself taking a stack of papers home in order to mark them, but there's just something on TV that you can't miss? Well, not anymore. I'm here today to present the self-assess stamp. Our utopian society, blah, 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 proficient. Something about ancient Aztecs, extending, math tests, something about percent, sure, developing. Well, I can see how it would save teachers time, but I still think teachers need to read the students' work. Meh. Does this work for teacher report card comments? Our final presenter, Mr. Rogers, wishes there was a manual for this annual dilemma. Hello Jaguars. September is a month of excitement and renewal in schools all across the country. But every year it's the same thing. You're hit with that sinking feeling. There's something weighing you down. It's the realization that you need to do another one of those grade seven farewell speeches. Sure, it was fun at first, but then the ideas start running out. Well, Jaguars, I'm excited to announce to you a product that solves all of these problems. I present to you Grad Libs. Sounds interesting. Tell us how it works. It's simple. You just fill in the information on one of these sheets and voila, you've got your year-end speech. Show up 10 minutes before farewell and you're done. Here, I'll let you try one out. Let's hear it. This is the four millionth year of school. And after centimeters of learning and making lots of furry memories, you have galloped to the end of your elementary school journey. We couldn't be jumpier or more scared of your accomplishments. We couldn't be squishier or more hot of your accomplishments. We couldn't be madder or more purple of your accomplishments. You have shown yourselves to be saucy, drab, zealous, jolly, smelly, loud, and slimy. You set a weird example for your younger bananas. Elementary school may be under, but a whole upside down of opportunities awaits you. As you move on from JKE, always remember, when one clothing hamper closes, another one opens. When one monkey closes, another opens. When one aglet closes, another opens. Also, remember to brush your teeth and don't forget to putt. Also, remember to floss and don't forget to squat. Lastly, the key to success is always stay soft and keep slapping yourself. The key to success is always to stay batty and to keep smelling yourself. We wish you all the best of luck in the next desk of your lives. We know you're going to do slippery things. Come back and yawn. Come back and clap. Come back and holler. Come back and skip. Your grubby teachers. Good afternoon, Jaguars. I am so rusty. Uh, yep. Yeah, exactly. Great job, Tor. Ah, I can't see Tor! <laughs> new teachers, new classes. It's <laughs> they specially formulated... That's hard to say. Speci okay. Something on TV that you can't miss? <laughs> 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 <laughs>
sorry, sorry, sorry. Patient <laughs> sits the pencil sharpener. And I forgot the rest. <laughs> uh, oh wait, oh it's recording now. Good afternoon, Jaguars. <laughs> this is Boosh Bomb, a specially formulated lipstick. Ah. Well, not anymore. So I'm annoyed by her? Like, okay, yeah. so.